Boston is the USOC's choice to represent the United States in its bid for the 2024 Summer Olympics. The city beat out LA, San Francisco, and Washington, D.C. The International Olympic Committee will name a final host in September of 2017. Yahoo Sports writer Jay Busby has been on this story for some time. Jay, first, why did the USOC go with Boston? And second, why not any of the other three? Well, this was a bit of a surprise. I think the uh, the betting money would have been on one of the California cities, particularly Los Angeles. Boston sneaks in and wins the opportunity to bid for the 24 Olympic Games. Boston offers something that none of the other cities did, and that's a high level of walkability. Despite what Spinal Tap said, Boston is a big college town, and in its bid, it intends to use the more than 100 colleges and universities in its area as potential venues sites for lodging and so forth for the Games. There will need to be an Olympic Stadium constructed, but there's a lot of the infrastructure that's already in place for Boston. Now, that's kind of the issue with several of the other cities. Los Angeles, it already has a number of the venues in place, but there is a sense that that the Olympics has already been to to Los Angeles twice, and therefore it's a little bit of been there, done that. San Francisco faced a lot of infrastructure challenges as well as traffic ones, both California cities did. Washington is such a political spot that it's entirely possible the USOC wanted to dodge that entirely and avoid any kind of preferential treatment, avoid any kind of protest, and just stay out of the Washington area entirely. Thanks, Jay. Boston joins Rome as the only other city that has officially decided to bid. The last time the Olympics were on U.S. soil was the 2002 Winter Olympics in Salt Lake City. The last summer games in the States were the 1996 Atlantic Games. Hit us up on Twitter and give Yahoo Sports a follow on Instagram. Thanks for watching.